Hello everyone, this video is about 2020 Lexus RCF Track Edition. So let's start. The RCF Track Edition uses the same naturally aspirated 5 liter V8 uh, that powered the ISF sedan in 2008 and the standard RCF since 2015. It is the engine Lexus uh, also uses in the LC500 Coupe and the GSF sedan. Uh, the company's uh, strict uh, warranty PT standards means the engine is limited 500 HP, said Yuichi Tsurumoto, sorry if I pronounced it wrong, then uh, uh, the uh, chief engineer on the um, RCF track edition and the man responsible for all Lexus F models. So, Super, uh, supercharging the uh, engine uh, was uh, out of the questions, uh, increasing the V8's uh, displacement to 5.5 liter or more uh, was explored, uh, but then the RCF uh, track edition would have been uh, subject to a gas uh, gusset tax uh, and that uh, too was uh, deemed uh, unacceptable. Uh, the frustration in Tushar Moto's voice was clear. And uh, while the 5 liters uh, output uh, has been increased slightly for 2020 up to 472 horsepower uh, plus, uh, at, uh, plus 5 at uh, 7100 rpm and 395 uh, pound uh, feet of torque plus 6 at uh, 4800 rpm. Uh, and the RCF uh, track edition doesn't uh, get any more power than the uh, RCF uh, mm, both versions of the coupe also continue to, to, uh, to use an isolating supplied 8-speed uh, automatic which is essentially unchanged. Uh, Lexus is only going to build around 400 uh, RCF track editions uh, and it will import just 50 into the United States that's all. Uh, just 50 cars uh, and they are uh, going to cost uh, $97,675 including a uh, $1,025 uh, destination fee. Uh, who cares uh, about the gas guzzles, uh, guzzler tax uh, on such an extreme limited uh, rum of a uh, $100,000 factory uh, hot rod. Uh, in the age of 797 HP Red Eye and 640 HP Cadillac, the 472 HP RCF track edition may not uh, sound like it uh, would be quick, but it, it is. Uh, with its uh, a new launch control and shorter uh, 3.13 to 1 rear end ratio, Lexus says it can uh, sprint to 60 mph uh, in 3.97 seconds. That's just uh, a tenth uh, or two of uh, the performance of the LFA. Unfortunately, uh, it is uh, also only two tenths quicker than the standard RCF, uh, which uh, Lexus says now hits 60 mph in 4.2 seconds. Throttle response is uh, uh, started then. Uh, we can say that before, before thanks to a redesigned uh, airbox. With uh, with increased flow and uh, smaller uh, but less uh, restrictive air filters, uh, a flap in the system which uh, increase volume and sound uh, now opens uh, uh, at uh, 2800 rpm, uh, that's 800 rpm uh, sooner than before, although we are not sure this is uh, 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 relevant uh, as many RCF owners modify to flap to stay open all of the time. So take a look uh, at this car guys. So today we are comparing Discovery Sports versus Mercedes Benz GLB. So take a look at this car guys. If you like any of these, please let me know in the comment section. Thank you for watching guys if you like this video please like comment and share thank you bye bye